Hello, this is Chad Sinclair with Corby. Let's discuss another featured tax saving strategy built into the Corby software, the Family Office Management Company. This strategy occurs when a family creates a separate company to provide management and financial advisory services to various family holding companies and operating businesses as well as individual family members. The income from the management contract is revenue to the management company that can then be turned into salaries, benefits, and business expenses for family members, often in lower tax brackets. So in essence, if you have family members that can perform the same work as other outside advisors that the taxpayer's company normally employs, the company taxpayer would benefit and the family members would as well. Also, the management company may qualify to deduct some expenses that individual family members could not deduct on their personal returns. The family office management company strategy requires a great deal of work. The company must be set up in a continuous and business-like manner with the purpose of making a profit and not just as a way to funnel expenses from the taxpayer's company. It should have a full-time staff that receives salaries and benefits who actively participate in the business. But if done correctly, there are other tax planning strategies that can be worked into the management company. Additional paperwork and tax returns will be required to form this new business entity and an attorney may need to be partnered with. Here are the conflicting strategies and entity types that work with this strategy.